How's it going, everybody? Today we are going to talk about delegation and can we delegate to to more than two data providers. Here's a tweet from Twitter from Flare Metrics Development Team Team Rowley. You can delegate to more than two data providers, but here's the catch: Flare Songbird supports two delegation methods. A delegation by percentage which you've likely used by now and b explicit delegation percentage delegation is restricted to two addresses this is because when a transfer of tokens is made by a delegator the vote power of the delegated addresses must be updated to reflect the change in the delegator's balance which costs gas. The more addresses a delegator delegates to, the more updates needed, equals more gas used. So what if you want to delegate to more addresses? That's where explicit delegation comes in. If you explicitly delegate, delegate tokens, you set the exact amount to be delegated but this balance is locked. To transfer these tokens again, you must explicitly undelegate them. Also, when new tokens enter the account, you must delegate the new tokens unlike percentage delegation where it's done for you. This makes it an unattractive option for most users but it has a use case for example it enables the apps decentralized applications to hold your tokens and delegate for you a d apps smart contract can hold a group of users tokens and dynamically handle these explicit delegations for each user allowing you to use their service and benefit from the FTSO system with freedom of choice. There is a reason for everything on the Flare network. One last note on this. Once you choose which method you want to use, explicit or percentage, your address is locked into the, that option. You cannot switch between the two. So I ask the question, what delegation in percentage will forever only will be up to two providers? The answer, it's determined by governance. If people feel it's best to change the maximum number of percentage delegations allowed, it can be proposed. There currently are no proposals for this. The second question I ask, what is explicit delegation? Can it be done directly within Bifrost account or it means we have to directly delegate Songbird on the provider's website? Any risk, any downsides? He answered, as far as I know, there are no public platforms allowing explicit delegation. It's done similar to how percentage delegation is done, which is through a smart contract call against the token you wish to delegate example rap songbird or fs's third question quotations that he wrote before if you explicitly delegate tokens you said the exact amount to be delegated by this balance is locked to transfer these tokens again you must explicitly and delegate them quotation closed so I asked, so we have to pay double. He, he said, the only thing you pay is fees. So yes, you will need to pay fees when delegating and undelegating. And last question, with explicit delegation, is there a limit to how many providers we can delegate to? He said, there is no limit. And he continues, an address is locked into which delegation method is used. If it used 
percentage delegation once it will never be able to use explicit delegation and vice versa. Realistically, explicit delegation probably shouldn't be used unless it's absolutely required, such as smart contracts handling users' funds that wishes to allow dynamic delegations. Percentage delegation is the easiest and quickest method of delegation. Also, as another note, increasing the maximum number of percentage delegation allowed would negatively impact network performance and increase cost of transferring tokens.